Test, 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 test. Hello, hello. All right, <clears throat> we're back at it. This is the day, everyone. Hello, everyone. Welcome back. Today is the day. All right. I know I say that a lot, but today is the day. Well, it's one of the days that I may pass this non-stop, 100% perfect, without losing one life. Now, it may not happen in the beginning of the day, but it will happen at some point. So, let's get right into it. I'm gonna turn off the lo-fi and bring up the Switch audio. Here we go, get a little hype with the Dragon's Lair music. All right, now everybody should know, or if you don't know the rules, I'll basically go through them. This is a game called Dragon's Lair, made in a uh, Dragon's Lair, made in about the yeah, like 83 mark, 1983. Uh, originally an arcade game, it has directional cues, so it means you press up, down, left, right, or attack, and uh, you get you get three lives. But I'm trying to do a 100% perfect um, game. So that means I can't die a single time. If I do die, I have to uh, forcefully restart the game. So that's one thing that I uh, forgot to mention uh, yesterday, is that this game, since I bought, I don't know if the original um, game gave you three lives as well, but this game on the Switch, which is the console I'm playing on, gives you three lives to pass the entire game. Now I want to pass the entire game in one life, so if I do die, I have to restart the game. That's just that's just the rule I put on myself. Um, and also, there are several rooms that we have never seen that I'm going to have to either beat on just watching the, like on the middle center of the uh, screen. You can sometimes see some little yellow highlighted bits that will show you which directional cue to press. Now in some of the rooms I'll get lucky and I'll just like push the right one, but on some of them I die because I've never seen that room before and it'll just kill me because I that's a new room that I experience. And I know I'm not talking too much about like what my method is in uh, passing this first run. I sort of figured that I'd die already <laughs> because I'm talking and playing, but apparently I'm at my best in the very beginning. Okay, this one I'll die. Up, attack, oh, oh gosh, attack, and then right, oh it was down, it was down! Okay, well, alright, so I'm able to talk a little bit more now. I was kind of planning this that, you know, I'm not going to try to pass it in the very beginning just because it's sort of like when you wake up you don't really do your best you know you're kind of still groggy and and things like that well same thing for me when i start uh streaming i sort of have <laughs> like these initial nerves especially if i'm trying to do something like this right like if i'm trying to do a 100 percent perfect run it, it like the nerves are there Okay, so I'll explain a little bit more per room on this one, just in case this is the one that I pass. I doubt it will be, but it'd be pretty cool. So this room is just one trigger. It goes, you click up, and that's all you have to do. There's some rooms that have multiple uh, triggers. This is a right. I missed the timer on that. Um, but that leads us into another point as well, right? Where this game, when it originally came out, it wasn't just about, like, you know, you moving in the right direction like it, it, like you have to take into account timing as well so from when it tells you hey click right there's like a few seconds in between that you can uh press that button before it kills you so on this one it's just four lefts so we're gonna press one two um three and then the last one four here Next room, this will, this horse is pointed to the right, so it's going to go left, right. So left, then right, then another left, right. And then two rights after this one. So one, and then two. So yeah, some of this is sort of like muscle memory, where it's just, I remember how things are posted. Like this one is going to be left, right, left, right, four up, and then right, left, right, left, right. So, and then a final right on the last one. 
So this is the part where you press the up directional uh, key four times. So that was one, two, this will be three, and then four coming up. Uh, this next one is the green water, so it's just right, left, right, left, and then at the end when you see the chain, you press right again. So that it, it's a lot of the game is that just memorizing what the certain patterns are. But I always found it curious that this was in the era of like arcade games, right? So you'd go, you'd put your quarter in. He's jumping to the left right here. And uh, you'd wait right in a line to put in your quarter or your token, and then you'd play the game. Um, now, for me, I bought the game on my Switch, so I can play as much as I want. But imagine if you went, like, I pressed it too early. <laughs> I killed myself because I pressed it too early. All right, well, anyways, um, imagine you go right to the mall or, or wherever they had arcades with this particular uh, cabinet. Um, and you went with maybe four quarters, right? It's not like you could just hoard the machine, right? Like there was always a line of kids behind you or a group of kids gathered around you, um, depending on the popularity of the game, right? And um, yeah, if, if <laughs> it was basically like in a basketball court where a kid says, you know, I have next, you know, just because you're on the court or you're on the cabinet doesn't mean that you like can hog the cabinet so now the horse is pointing left so it'll be right left right left 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 um but i always wondered if there was maybe there was a kid who you know passed this game 100 percent on the first life you know i would i would like to figure out like how they did it because you have to either just be standing there watching people pass things that you're sort of struggling on and remembering the room. Uh, it's easy for us because we can just automatically restart. Like I paid, I forgot how much I paid for this, maybe $20 um, on the Nintendo Switch and I can play countless amount of times, right? So I think on my channel, I already have like eight hours worth of this game, not including this video, which I'm planning to uh, stream for about two hours so for me it's like I just pay twenty dollars and you know I can play as much as I want I have played as like at the end of it I want to figure out how many times I actually played oh and I should mention that this is on easy difficulty with guided um, cues added I was thinking of trying on hard difficulty the exact same thing, but without, you know, visual cues. I, I it, It's taken me a long time just to do this with visual cues. I don't know if I'm going to do that. If I do ever pass this game... Oh, this one's a tough one. Attack, up, and then attack. Oh, it was right. Okay, well... That's another point we have to talk about. Some of these rooms will be rooms that um, I don't frequently get. You know, they're less frequent in, in, you know, how you get the layout of the rooms, right? The route of the rooms is always different or can always be different. Sometimes it is the same. So some of these rooms I'll be less familiar with and I will forget the pattern it's kind of just all up to RNG, you know, just like randomly getting the best possible rooms that you can get. But for the most part, I will die because I forget a particular room. Like that one, it had been a long time since I got that. So right, left. Then another right, left. Oh, I almost missed that one. And then two lefts. So one, two. And we're done. Okay. That's it. I, I actually like the horse one. I do because it usually most of the time leads to this water stage, which is like an insane amount of points um, that you end with after this. So I started at around like 4,900, I think. I know it was like around 400, yeah. Okay, so now we're at 8,000 and then I think it'll take us to 10,000. I'm pretty sure it will. Um, 
I believe there's some correlation to like how much points you have and how long the game takes. Uh, some of the smaller rooms obviously don't give you as much points as if like you were playing a big game like this or a big map like this. Not a map, I guess a room. But I'm at 10,000, so most likely I would say I'm like a third of the way done. I think you passed. I pressed it early. I cannot find the timing for that. Um, I want to say the full game gives you 30,000 points. I believe that's accurate to say. I don't know if that's 100% true as far as like... Because there's obviously got to be a method for high score. Which I thought was if you pass this perfectly without any deaths, you'll get more than... 50,000 points but when I did pass this game I did pass it with 30,000 points or maybe 3,000 points I'm not sure I wouldn't be surprised if I had 3,000 points and thought it was 30,000 points the score was the least of my concern when I was trying to pass this game the first time around and while I was passing it I was really just uh, playing through like I, if I died in a map I didn't restart I just kept going which I do get a lot. A lot of people do tell me, you know, well, why don't you, um, you know, a lot of my friends that watch, you know, they're like, why don't you just continue, right? Like, if you die, it'll kick you to the next room. Why not just continue that room? And to that, I mean, yeah, sure, you can, but I feel like it's not the challenge. And also, you're not really learning the previous room. You're not learning the next room. And I am, I am truly the worst at this. You know, YouTube tells me I'm the worst at this, but they recommend that throughout my video, I should tell you all that if you enjoy the content you're watching, to consider leaving a like, commenting, and subscribing. I'm horrible at that. I'm kind of like, the way I think of YouTube and the way I handle my channel is that people are gonna subscribe no matter what, right? So. I guess if I say subscribe, maybe two or three people will subscribe, but people are just going to want to see the content they're going to want to see anyways. Um, and I kind of like just playing the games, like if I were back in, you know, when I was younger, in elementary or like middle school or something, and I was uh, going to a friend's house, right? You don't go to your friend's house and it's like, hey, and if you like this, you know, content please consider doing this like no it's it, you're just going it's like all right let's load the game let's start let's let's continue playing from where we left off i was on a tangent there but yeah okay we'll, we'll, we'll do we'll, we'll forget that ever happened this is warm up all right yesterday's video was me getting back after a vacation this is like okay at some point I'm, it's gonna click at some point it will click honestly and that's kind of this game. We have to click the right buttons. So let's get at it. This will be just up. So this one might actually take us longer to get to 10,000, just depending on what they do. Okay, yeah, this is, that's fine. So it's left, right. And then um, two lefts at the end. I mean, two rights, two rights at the end. So right, uh, right. And then there you go, room two done. I used to think that it was the number of rooms, like you would get a certain number of rooms um, and then you'd pass the game, but I don't know if that's accurate. I, I feel like the game does a well, like a really good job of randomizing your experience. This one is going to the right, so we have to wait for the cutback, there we go. 10,000 points already, that's not bad. We didn't even get the water one on this one, I think. Two lefts and a right. So one, uh, two, and then this right right here. There we go. Uh, this is up, attack, down, up. So up, attack, growth, and then down, and up. Yeah, uh, yeah, I mean, I do like the style of the game. Um, it's very much like a movie from the from the 80s. Like, you think of the old Cinderella movie, you think of, like, the old, uh, 
cartoons at that time, you know, uh, DuckTales, Tailspin? Was, it, was Tailspin one of them? Hmm. I'm trying to think of that Alvin and... No, not it wasn't even Alvin. It was uh, Dale and... Uh, what was his brother? The Chipmunks. Dale and... Dale and something. Oh, man. Why, why can't I figure it out? Dale and Chuck? Was Chuck one of them? I don't think it was Chuck. Dale and... That's gonna kill me. But yeah, the little, uh... It was like, Tailspin... Detectives, or something like that. I might be misinterpreting it. But yeah, it has that sort of feel, right? The, the old school coloring and all that. Nowadays, everything feels very, like, beautiful. Like, everything is just so... The colors are so animated and everything... Uh, the design is really well done. But this still has like a charming, older feel to it. Alright, here we go. Two rights on this one. This room is usually always right. I've never seen it go left. I missed the trigger. Alright. I'm gonna get a little bit of water. I don't want y'all to hear me drinking. So I will mute myself for a little bit. Y'all can enjoy the title screen music. All right, here we go. Let's get back into it. Now, one of the things I was thinking of doing was when I do eventually do 100%, like zero death, uh, full amount of points you can get which I th I honestly think I won't be able to do like I don't think you can get a full amount of points because if the next room is the one that says drink me I don't know how to drink that vial oh never mind uh, horse is pointing left so we're going right left and then two lefts at the end excuse me there we go one more okay cool What's this room? This is uh, left, right, left, right, up, 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 up. Right, left, right, left, right. Oh, and then I was actually talking to... Uh, I really should stop talking while I'm playing video games. I think that's why a lot of people like watching longer streams because so much can happen when you're live. Like if I were to just sit down, learn these rooms, I think it'd be over in one stream, honestly, but I like talking to my audience, right? And not only my audience, like in the live stream as well as out of the live stream, like just in general, like you have people that watch this that probably will never talk to you, right? You, they won't subscribe or anything, but um, for a split second, you know, you have them, right? This one, I don't know how to drink that potion. And I think that potion may give you extra points. Or it may do something. But I was talking to someone and I was like, uh, I was explaining to them the premise of this game and they were like, it seems kind of boring. And I go, yeah, in a way, yes, but like, there are some times where it says press up and I'm over here like pressing down. I like, it, just the anxiety of the game itself as well is very, uh, difficult to deal with like it's it's a really tough game like it may look silly and I've obviously memorized most of the uh, directional cues but that doesn't mean that I still won't die right like I like I think I'm gonna be streaming for about two hours today and the very likelihood that I pass a hundred percent without dying once, it's like a 20 to 30% that I'll probably do that today. Maybe 50% on the off chance that I just nail every single directional cue and we get like every single thing accurately. But I, I'm leaning more to like 35% that I'll pass it today. So this is right. This room is also always right. I've never seen it go left. This is left, right, left, right. 
And then another left, right. This is going to be up, 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 up. So one, two, three, and four. Okay, this one will be right, left, right, left, right, right. Uh, one thing, like, and once you start playing the game, you sort of start seeing things. Like when this guy paddles, you can pretty much press and it'll accept it. And on this one, just look at the chain. There we go. We're good. This will be to the left based on how he's standing. There we go. That's a very easy, or not an easy room. You can die on that room. I have died on that room. But uh, for the most part, oh, okay, wait a little bit. So now, there we go. Um, it's just on timing. This one's five rights. That first left, then five rights. One. Uh, two. Three. Um, here's four. Uh, it was a little early there. Five. A little early there, too. And then attack. Six times. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Cool, cool, cool. We got it, we got it, we got it. Okay, okay, we're doing pretty decently. We're already at 24,000. This one's just a simple right at the end. So you wait, 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 then press right. I think you can also get that diamond. Three attacks in and up, this is great. So one, two, three, up. Nice. This is attack, right, attack, up. Attack, right, attack, up. Come on, come on, right or left? Right, up, left, up. My timing's off on this. Right, up, attack, left, up. Left, and then up. Oh, I was early on those two. Okay. All right, here we go. Here we go. Right or left? Left. Right. Up. Right. Left. Right. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, no, no. Oh. 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 That is such a long room. I did not think it was going to keep going that long. Okay. Before I forget, it was... It was left, right, up, right, left, or was it down? Left, right, left, right, up, right, down, left, right. I want to say that's right. I want to say that's right. But that was insane. That was the best we've ever done in that room. Honestly, the best we've ever done. I think I, I, the reason why is because I remembered. So the fourth directional trigger on that room is the second directional trigger in that same room. So if you start by going left, then right, your fourth trigger will be right. So it'll be left, right, up, right. And that's the same if it's flipped around. If you go right, left, up, the second directional cue was left. So it'll be right, left, up, left. Oh, that was cool. That was so cool. A after that fourth directional cue, it was all just like I was looking at the directional cues, not really remembering anything and just going on pure adrenaline. That was so good. That was the best. Honestly, to this day, that was probably the best we've ever done. So that's cool to see. Like every, every day, it's getting better. Okay, so it's pointing left, so we're going right, left. And that, like, a run like that makes me want to play this game even more. I want to get back to there. I want to do that stage better next time, this time. Um, and that's the fun part of this game, right? That sometimes it is frustrating. Like, sometimes I do, like, oh, why did I die at such a silly, you know, moment? But when you get a good run like that, that's it's just amazing. I'm, I'm already hyped. I'm already hyped because of that one room. It's gonna be a left. We wait for the cutback and then left. There we go. 
if you press it early, you do die on this stage, so. Oh, and if you miss that first Q, there is a secondary Q, and I think even third Q. I'm not sure how deep it goes, but it does, um, it does have several options from there. I pressed it too early. I got a text and I pressed it early. Okay, quit. Oh, I'm, I'm so hyped. I'm so ready. Let's. I feel it in my bones. We're gonna get past that checkered room. Um, we've never gotten past the checkered room, but when you die, it does kick you forward to the next room. And the next room, I've noticed after that checkerboard, it's it's two of them. One that's kind of like a seesaw, and one that's that uh like vat of of liquid, like red liquid. So we have absolutely no knowledge on those two rooms, the seesaw room and the um, the vats of, of liquid. So if we do eventually get past um, the checkerboard one, uh, we'll get a little bit more information as to both of those. Right, because you're only you only end up progressing once you feel comfortable with each room. And being able to accurately like remember which sightings. This is a right. I pre I almost pressed that early. I pressed that early enough to where I would have died. I don't know why it didn't kill me. Wait for the chomp. I pressed it early. Dang it. Dang it. That is one room. Record will show that that electrical room is one of my most I loathe that room I dislike that room so much because it kills me more than anything else all right let's continue okay play game here we go here we go we're gonna get it okay I feel it I feel it my goal today is to get past the checkered room um, and possibly learn that one um, it's usually like the fifth or sixth room the one where it's uh, the tentacles that come down, it's attack up right attack right, I think. It might be left. At some point we do go back left. Uh, this will be three lefts. So one, two, three. There we go. Pretty good. This will be, le oh, this is a good one. This is a good run, I already love it. Left, right, left, right. Then you press up four times. So here we go. Once he paddles, one, two, three, four. We're good, then right, left, right, left, right. When he paddles as well, so right. Uh, left, right, um, left, and then when you see the chain, right. Here we go. That's how you do that one. Oh, great. Left or right. This is left. Wait for the cutback and right. I mean, sorry, left. Let's see what we get next. On the bat room, too. We haven't had that one either. Here we got it. Wait for a bit. There you go. Up. Attack down up. Attack. Growth down. Growth. Up. Attack attack. Left attack attack. So attack. Attack. Left. Attack. Wait for a bit, because we have some time. We're at 30,000 right now. Nice, okay, this is gonna be the room that's gonna get us. Oh, great, amazing. Attack, three attacks and up. Oh, I'm pressing him early, I'm nervous. There we go. These let it be the monkey room. Left attack, left, left. Left. And then left, yeah. This one's up, up. Right. Attack, it was attack! Oh! Oh! 
Wow. One room away. We were one room away. Okay, there's two bat rooms, apparently. So there's two stair rooms. One that takes you up, which is the monkey room, where it's attack, right attack, up. Then there's the second stair rooms with bats that I've completely forgotten because we don't get it too much. We don't get it as often as we should. And that was going to be the checkered room. And then we have this one where I think it's like two or three stages of where the uh, ladder or the floorboards are falling down. We don't get it as often as we should and I wish we got it more so that way I can learn the freaking pattern. Um, but that was a good run. That was still a really good run. I really, really, really like that run as well. Okay, this one is four left, so one, two, three, four. It's taken us a while, yeah. For sure, I mean... <sighs> I don't really like looking online, like... And, and you'll learn this sort of from, like, my previous, um videos that I don't really like going online and getting the answers, right? I like solving them on my own, you know, especially video games, you know, why would you spend $60 on a video game, right? Just to then go to the internet and be like, hey, help me solve my game. And then you finish it and you're like, oh, I'm, yeah, I beat that game. Like, no, you didn't. You, you went online, somebody else beat it. And then you just copied what they were doing. So I don't know. That's just my opinion. I enjoy struggling through a game. <laughs> and sure, there are probably people that enjoy watching somebody else play a game. And then going into their game and playing it. Which I get too. I'd rather somebody tell me in chat though. I'd rather somebody say like, hey try this. Or hey this room is this. Versus me... Um, you know, going online, just seeing the game, and then playing the game as if I were beating it for the first time. Uh, it does remind me a lot of, like, when I was in school, um, and we'd go over to my friend's house, and, you know, you would be stuck on a stage, but they would be ahead of you, and it's like, oh yeah, you know, let's play it together, let's learn it together, let's pass the stage together, you know? Okay, let's let's restart because I am definitely I'm kind of salty I'm gonna admit it my salt levels are a little bit higher than normal because of that one room that one run that would kept us right from the uh, checkerboard I'm a little salty yeah that's it <laughs> no I, I I enjoy the game I do I do like the game it's just it, you know sometimes it do it does that to you Okay, here we go. We're getting it. We're getting it. This is gonna go right, left. So, right, left, right, left, and then two more lefts. So, one, two. Yeah. No, yeah. Well, I guess, yeah, it sh I, I, I think I should um, mention that. Uh, the intro lo-fi music or outro lo-fi music that I use comes from a fellow YouTube channel called uh, Stompy's Playlist. Uh, a very great channel. Highly recommend it for both just personal use as well as content creators. Um, so I love using lo-fi. I feel like lo-fi is very calming, very... It lends itself very well to being like a content creator's best friend. Um, but of recently, like recently of like the f past few maybe years, um, I've been having some issue with copyright infringement, right? So I, you know, I bounce around through lo-fi channel and lo-fi channel and, you know, I would still get copyright, you know, music. So I was kind of like, well, that kind of sucks, right? I don't want to go to, you know, pay or whatever for, you know, for music, right? Uh, like. I feel like content creators should look out for each other, and uh, that's basically what Stompy does, right? Uh, Stompy's playlist that, that... I'm dying on the easy levels, guys. I am. That's just... That's just a fact. Like, that's just six downs and an up. I'm dying. 
Okay. Anyways, Stompy's playlist, uh, they do a really great job of if you credit them, they will allow you to use their music. I make sure to put their link to their channel, both on the description and as well as when I upload the playlist. Um, or when I upload this video, it'll have a link to their channel. I'm using their Lo-Fi Study Music Mix 2021. If anyone is interested, that's where you can find it. Okay, let's get back into it because I feel like I feel like my salt levels are going down. You know, I'm breathing a little bit more. It's gonna be left, right, left, right. So left, right, left, right. And then two more rights, so one, two. All right, there we go, easy. All right, up attack, up attack, left attack. There we go, left and attack. All right, cool. This is two rights. So one, two. One thing that I do find kind of funny is that, you know, a lot of individuals that watch my videos may watch... This is like the fifth, fourth, fourth, fifth time I've streamed this. I know that it, I know it got a little bit mucky because I accidentally streamed on like a kid thing, like kids YouTube. And I was like, wait, it's not the same thing. <laughs> I thought it like I've never I've always seen the little check mark like is your content for kids and I usually just put no like the standard one but I think that day I was just like because every time I have to live stream I have to edit like I have to put you know what video game it is so that way it's broadcasted or it's labeled towards that particular video game right you don't want to go up and look for Call of Duty and find this right you want to look for this in this category um, so I was going rapidly and it was just so easy to just click on things that I think I clicked for kids and I was like, wait, why is my live chat not, why is nobody talking, you know, why is it not going? So I immediately turned it off and was like, well, goodbye. <laughs> and then I started actually streaming uh, that day. So it kind of like, it's kind of like two separate streams, but that one I'm counting as one. So we've streamed this like four or five times and, um, I always find it, I press left there, I always find it weird that like I have to constantly go back and um, uh, re-explain things, like per room and all that, but it's very true that some people would or could watch, you know, the fourth episode versus the first episode. So if the fourth episode doesn't have as much information as the first episode as to what I'm doing, what I'm trying to do, they're going to they're going to be kind of lost, right? Like I it's very easy for me to just be like, well, some people should have watched the first episode. But I've been trying to get better at that as well. So this will be left right left right because the horse is pointing right. And then uh it'll be two rights after this one. So one, two, there we go. Next room. It's gonna be left, right, left, right. So one, two, three, four. There we go. And then this will be up four times. So one, two, three. Four. Okay, and this next one should be right, left, right, left, right. So right, left, right, left, and when you see the chain, right. Okay, here we go, here we go. What are we getting? Okay, pretty decent. I have never seen this room that deep into the game. Well, actually, have I seen it after the water? I think I have seen it after the water. So one, two, wait a little bit. Right there. Okay, up, attack down up. So attack, wait for the growth, down, wait for the growth again, up. 
Okay, attack, attack, right, attack, attack. So, attack. Attack. Right. And that's right because the anvil was at the left side of the screen when we loaded into the game. If it was on the right side, it'd be the opposite direction. So, attack. This one's the one. This one, this level right now. Up attack. Up attack, down attack, right. Okay, this next one too. Okay, great. Attack, right, attack, up. Attack, right. Attack, up. This should be the either the wind one or the... Oh, great. Okay, up, up, attack. So, attack, right, right. Okay. Okay, checkers one. Let's go. Let's go. This is right, left. It's gonna be up left. Left. Right. Left. Right. Oh, I no, I didn't do it right. Oh, I was late. That's fast. That is comparatively faster than any other time. Wow, that is fast. Okay, we learned a few things. So it's, uh, I entered, it was left, right, or right, left, depending on which one you get. But after that, it goes up and the second trigger, right? So it was up, let's say it was right, left, up, left. After that, it's just right, left, and then I think right again. Yeah, I think I died on right again. So. I'm kind of like, I kind of want to go back. I want to go back. So actually, let's see. It was right, left, up, left, right, left. So it basically repeats itself. I think it repeats itself. Or no, 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 it doesn't repeat itself because the third... On the second set, the third one was right again instead of up. So it'll be like right, left, up, left, right, left. So that part does repeat. The first, second are on the fifth, sixth, I think. Okay, so interesting, interesting. We're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. I'm remembering I'm remembering that room. Right, left, up, left, right, left. Up, attack. Up. Attack. Pretty soon it'll be kind of it, it'll be like this one. That's the thing with with rooms like that, like the checkerboard one, it's very time sensitive. And if you're learning the room, you're just like picking up one directional cue at a time, but once you learn them, it, it, it you know, I, re I would relate that one more to the, uh, the one where we have to, oh, I pressed it early. The checkers room is actually like the one that's, that has that falling, um, spider. The one where it's like right, up, left, up, right, up, attack, left, up. It's like that one. Um, if you mess up once, you're dead on either rooms. So yeah, yeah, no, I, I, I mean, I enjoy it. I, I think the best part of this game is that it's never the same or it, 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 some rooms are the same, but the feeling of it is never truly the same. Um, the slight changes in the room or just in general, if you play this game, you always feel like you have to be on the top of your game because you don't know what the next room might be. And even though it is the same room, there's still a chance of like, well, I may mess up at any point. So I do like this game. I, I absolutely love this game. Um, I play this game off stream. I try not to. I try not to because that's kind of, I like to experience it here with you all. But um, sometimes I do, sometimes just for fun. I don't try as hard as, as, uh, as I do while, you know, obviously streaming. A challenge where I have to beat the game in one life <laughs> but I do play the game right I would say I have nearly I don't know like 20 20 ish hours uh, it's a fairly new game and I don't I haven't really checked how many hours I've played on it but it's a good amount I would be I wouldn't be surprised if it was near 40 hours but at the very least a conservative guest is 20 because I know I've streamed about 15. And if I've played twice as much 
as I stream. Well then, yeah, up at around 30. Okay, so this one's up, up, left. The timing is so specific there. I honestly shouldn't have talked. I should not have said anything on that particular stage because it's so finicky. That room is so precise. Okay, so play, new game, play. Uh, oh, and it, just if anybody was wondering, that is something that I don't do often in most of my games. So for lives, I noticed, I'm pretty sure you've noticed that there's left and right arrows. Three is, like, I'm, that three is the lowest you can go, five being the most. So I keep it at three. Uh, move beeps are basically when you press a, a directional cue correctly, it'll beep. Um, and if you press it wrong, I think it'll do like a, like an X or something. Uh, move guides are basically um, the bottom middle section. It'll show you like what trigger you need to do. Uh, arcade cabinet, that's just the look of the game. And then mode, I'm playing it on arcade. Difficulty is on easy. Maybe I will do one of these days a hard difficulty. All right, one sec. Sorry about that. All right, let's get back into it. There we go. Had a call. <laughs> I basically, you know, had a call in like a few minutes. That's that's or a minute. I don't think I was gone more than a minute. All right, let's go. We're doing good. There we go. All right, great. This might be the one. So. That's actually another thing. Um, I always like to say that uh, our brains, just the way they work, we're usually learning the most in 30 to 45 minute increments, right? So for 30 and 45 minutes, your, your brain is working the best it can to process memory or process information, uh, turn that into long-term, short-term memory. Uh, basically, it's working its best in 30 to 5 minute increments. So if you truly wanted to like learn something, you would you know, work for 45 minutes and then stop, take a rest, uh, something that's not too taxing on your brain, and then you'd come back and you know, do another 30, 45 minutes. So maybe that phone call you know, refreshed a little bit of thing because my brain was on off mode. I wasn't really playing the game. So let's see if it did anything. We're going to try our hardest on this particular run to get it done. That room's done. This would be right, left, right, left, right, right, or no, 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 right, left, right, left, left, left. Here we go. Three lefts. One, two, three. All right. All right. All right. Let's do this. Let's do this. It's going to be left, right, left, right, four ups, and then a right, left, right, left, right. So another left, right. This will be four ups. So one, two, a three, and four. There we go. Pretty good. All right, right, left, right, left, right. So right left right left and then once you see the chain it'll be right cool uh recently i was talking to someone and they mentioned uh the previous stuff i was streaming was like episodic um versions of like games such as uh, Little Nightmares, which I am looking forward to playing Little Nightmares 2 in the near future, and uh, Limbo. 
and I completely forgot that I just stopped like midway or I don't even know how long Limbo is but I stopped playing Limbo uh, I do want to get back to it I will probably get back to it sometime this week uh, I just have to see you know I, I'm really feeling Dragon's Lair right now and the reason I stopped playing Limbo was because soon after Limbo's sort of sale they also had uh, Dragon's Lair on sale so I picked up Dragon's Lair immediately fell in love with it and have been playing it since then so it's not that I don't want to play Limbo, I will get back to it, just currently I'm feeling, you know, Dragon's Lair is my game right now. Okay, this is a right at the end, and I think you can pick up that diamond, I don't know how. Up attack, down attack. Down attack, and then right. There we go, what's the next room? Okay, right. Up, down, left. Oh, that's such a scary one. That's such a scary one too. Oh gosh. Up, up, attack, right, right. Up, I think. Right, right. Oh, oh okay, it just does up for you. Okay, here we go, here we go. It repeats. So right, left, up, right, left. It was left. Right, left, right. We did it! Oh my god! Oh, it was a t oh, 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 we are okay. We almost died. We almost died again. I did not know I needed to attack until I saw him pulling at his sword. We could have. We could have lost it all there. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. That's so. I'm so, my heart is going like 300 miles per hour right now. So just in case you missed it, we just passed the checkered room. Finally, after so long, we've passed the uh, checkers room. So uh, the the scenario I was presented was I started with right. Now everything that I'm saying is the same, but just flipped if you enter with left. So when I entered, it was right, left, up, left, right left right then you attack i believe that to be the accurate thing okay what's this oh well it was a right <laughs> oh and just like that and just like that three seconds later we die <laughs> oh gosh wow wow short-lived short-lived but a great one of the best moments in the game. My heart, oh, I was mortified when I saw that I had to attack again. Oh, that was so scary. I thought I was surely gonna die there. Imagine if, I like, cause you never know if like it stops or it continues, right? So imagine it continued like three other things after that. I would have died and not known the three other things. So I, I confirmed that you do the section, you attack the knight and that's over. Like your room is done. Oh gosh, I'm so giddy with like, I don't even know how to explain it. Okay, here we go. Alright, alright. Uh, four rights, so one, two... I honestly just want to go back to the night room, or the uh, checkers room. Okay, right here. Okay, let's do this. This is gonna be left, right, left, right, up, 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 up. Right, left, right, left, right. Okay, doing good, we're doing good. And I had nearly 50,000 points, or I think I was at 60,000 points. Like, that's insane. We can break 100,000, I think. If we do this perfectly, we get 100,000 points. Guaranteed, I think. Well, guaranteed, not guaranteed. But guaranteed. I feel like we're gonna get 100,000 points. We're gonna figure a way to get 100,000 points. Okay, here we go. Uh, one more left, and we have a last right. Once you see the chain, bam. Okay, we're kind of we're kind of low right now. We're at eight thousand. We're kind or not even eight thousand. This is a left. Wait for the cutback. Now, yeah, we're we're poor right now. We don't have as much points as we normally do. Two lefts and a right. 
This is one of my favorite rooms. I absolutely love the Headless Horseman room. It is designed so well. I wish it was longer. I honestly wish this that one room was longer. Uh, this one's an okay room too. The whole whole like Lynch King kind of thing. And then up. There we go. Uh, attack, attack. Left attack, attack. Because the anvil spawned on the right. So we're going left. There we go. Left. And then two more attacks. The second attack obviously being a bit of a ways away. So we can chill for a bit. And then attack. You're giving me... Oh, this room. Okay, up attack, down attack, right. Up, attack, down, attack, right. Here we go. What's the next one? Left attack, left, left. Attack, left. Oh, gosh. I, I was so slow on that. Left. Up, up, attack, right, 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 okay, this one's the one, I thought it was left, I thought it was left, oh, the, why, why, why wouldn't they just give us the checkered room? You know, oh man, I, this is what I tell you all. This game is so amazing in that no two experiences are the same. You oftentimes think, I have it down. You know, I figured it out. I can beat the game. And then it's like, no, you can't. Here's a room we haven't shown you in like 40 games. Ugh. But I love it. I love this game. If there's one game that I'm going to be sad to stop playing, it'll be this game. Once I've completed my challenges, it's just going to be, f it's going to feel so sad to like stop playing it. <sighs> okay, here we go, here we go. Okay, facing right, so we're going left, right, left, right. Left, right, left, right, right, right. So two more rights. One, two. Okay. Uh, left, right, left, right, up, 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 right, left, right, left, right. Go so left, right, left, right. Uh, and most of the triggers on this one is when he's paddling. I think on every single stage, it's when he paddles, press the up button. And the left, rights, as well as right, lefts. It's up for that last right. Excuse me, that last right is just based on when you see the uh, hanging chain. And honestly, it's whenever you see it, because I like to think that there's a differential between reaction time and visual cues. So you see the chain, you react a little bit later. And when you react a little bit later with the chain, um, it's actually like perfect timing for the directional cue. Gotta wait a little bit. There we go. Up, a, up, attack, down, attack. No, up, attack, down, up. Up, attack, down, and wait for the growth. Up. There we go. Attack, attack, right, attack, attack. So, attack. The anvil spawned on the left, so we're going to be moving to the right. Attack. And this next attack is not for a while. So attack, there we go, okay, this is the part, oh, this one's tough, this one, the, yeah, attack, up, right, attack, no, he was down, I pressed attack, oh, that's just poor, that's bad RNG, if I go the whole game without getting that room, I'd be perfectly fine. I absolutely hate that room and the um there's another room that's similar. I don't remember the other room either, but I, I just have very little for me in my gameplays. I, you can see them. I have like nearly 12 hours of this game. I feel like that room has come out less than 10% of my entire gameplay. 
it is very few times like you probably it's probably less than 20 times i've seen that room whereas the horse one i've seen that nearly 95 percent of my time playing this game i'd say i'd see that over 70 times and it just it hurts so bad when you get that one room you don't have any knowledge of so just to remember it was attack up right down attack right up down it might it might that might only be the only attack it might be something like attack up right down left right i know i know i've learned that room before i it's just it's oh now i'm now i'm just purposefully like not even remembering things because i'm trying to think of that one room <laughs> it's 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 bad I I'm stuck in the memory of that room um, I've remembered passing it and I don't remember if I attacked more than one time so yeah it, it's tough I mean it's it's hard when you get a room like that okay here we go uh, this will be four lefts so there we go four done all right, let's continue on. This is just a right. Uh, this is up attack, up attack, left attack. So up, attack, up, attack. And honestly, saying these moves helps me attack to remember when to hit the directional cues. And also just reminds you what to do in each room. This one's gonna be left or right. This is a left, wait for the cutback. So now. Okay, six downs and an up, uh, so one, two, three, four, five, six, and then up. There we go. Please be the water. Nope, okay. Up, attack, down, up. Attack, wait for the growth, down. Wait for the growth up. Okay, this one's just a right, so it's like a little in intermission. Whew, compose ourselves. This one's attack up, right down. Attack up, right down, left. It was up! I pressed right! I pressed right. Oh man, I pressed right. Wow. Wow. And see, the game knows, you know, not, not to go into like conspiracy theories or anything. The game knows. I was bad, bad mouthing that one room, and it's like, here you go again. Oh, that's rough. That is rough. Alright, let's continue. Let's just jump right into another game, right? That's what we do here. We're like, yeah, uh, sure, I died, but I'm gonna, you know, play the game. Play it again, play the game again, you know, d just get my heart hurt. Okay, four rights. One, two, three. I've seen this room so many times. Four. Going crazy, man. Every time, every time this happens to me, I just end up going insane. At the fact that I can't beat simple rooms. Okay. For left. Right. Have you do you all ever like start saying a word, but you mess it up? Like in your head you're like, I'm thinking of right, but I say left. I'm like, okay, time to press rule light. Like Here we go, here we go. Right. Left right can we do it left here we go wait for the chain right okay we're good left or right it's gonna be a right wait for the cutback right okay we're good we made it we made it okay two lefts and a right perfect my favorite stage left my favorite uh, room left and right okay there we go up attack down up 
up. Attack. Down. Up. Okay. Attack, attack, left, attack, attack. 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 Left. Attack. Wait for a bit. Attack. There we go. Okay. Oh, great. Three attacks. One. Two. Three. Up. What's the next one? Monkey? No, it's not. Okay, this one's right up. Down. Oh, I, I waited too long. I waited too long. See, that's another thing. So, whatever that last room is, so, like, I like to count room numbers. Whatever that room, though, the one with the snake one that it's like three attacks in and up. There's so many combinations and so many different possibilities of room in that section that I forget so simply like I, I in my mind I was thinking yeah this room's an easy room but it's not like that other room where it's like attack up left right I, oh, I just confused myself for no reason I should have vocally said my moves okay here we go. Left. 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 Okay. Done. Uh, this is going to be right. Uh, left, right, left, right. Up, 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 up. Right, left, right, left, right. Here we go. Up, 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 up. Okay, 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 we got it, right, left, right, left, right, right, left, right, left, and then one more right, as soon as you see the chain, there we go, okay, we got it, we got it, we're, we're poor on points, but we got it, left, right, this is left, wait for the cutback, and now okay here we go let's go what's the next room left left right left left right okay this is a uh, left five rights and then six attacks one Two, three, I, oh man, it hurts. Like it just, it physically hurts. Like it physically hurts how late I am on those like cues. I don't know what it is. And we're gonna be playing for another hour. <sighs> I need some water. Let's get some water. Oh, that's good water. That's good water. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna lay back. I'm gonna relax. Even if I die, I want to turn that part of my brain a little bit off. I want to like just go on autopilot mode for a bit, so that way I can, I can come back pretty strong. I kind of want the hour and fifteen minute mark to be my next like, let's go and let's do it, like really big on that move, at that time. So right now, I'm not saying anything. I'm not trying to overtax my brain. I'm just trying to play the game right now. I know I've played rooms like this before. I know I can get through them, but I'm not trying to illustrate to like an audience, which is also another thing that I, I feel takes away from uh, my brain power or just my memory power, uh, is that I do have to some way explain it to you all right like I have to because I never know when somebody is viewing my stream you know unless you're active on the stream on the chat saying hey I just joined what's going on um, but it's always best to just explain 
things multiple times, right? Or let a few minutes pass and then explain the rooms. But for the purposes of like going long term, I kind of want to take just a little bit of a, of a break. Just so that way I can come back at it stronger in about a, in about 15 minutes. So right now I'm just playing it. I've been playing this so long that <laughs> I don't need to say the moves and still perform well. But if I do make it to the checkers room, I'll start trying hard. Okay, this is the right guy. Uh, I'm saying it again. Don't say it. <laughs> it's so hard for me, you know? It's so hard to turn off the content creator part of things. And also because I just feel like there's a lot of dead air. So, I guess, let me talk about some random stuff. Uh, I was actually watching some YouTube uh, content creators playing. I went... I went right instead of left. That room always does that. That room does switch and I absolutely hate it. I, it's such a long, big room that I wish it would just stay the same every single time. But I understand. It's 50-50. You either press the right way or the wrong way. Um, but it's not a minute and 50, it's not an hour and 15 minutes yet. So I'm gonna keep talking about random stuff. Uh, this is gonna be sort of like a shameless plug, but you know, I do have some content creators that I enjoy watching, and why not help out the community as a whole? Uh, some of my favorite content creators are honestly, I don't know if they'll surprise any of my audience, but I play very indie, like very challenge based games, um, like Dragon's Lair, right? Not too many people are streaming Dragon's Lair on YouTube. So I, I personally love Dragon's Lair. That's why I want to stream Dragon's Lair. But on my off period, you know, when I'm off and I and I don't I'm not streaming, you know, what do I watch? Well, there are a lot of channels I like watching. So some of the bigger channels that I like watching are like the Try Guys, uh, Good Mythical Morning, um, and Good Mythical More too. I <laughs> I kinda like Red and Link as content creators, I feel like they do it really well. Uh, but yesterday I found myself watching this uh, smaller YouTuber called Leo D Gamer. So it's just literally Leo, uh, the letter D, and Gamer. And he was playing Call of Duty. Uh, I've never been good at Call of Duty. I will admit to you right now, I do play video games with my buddies, like Halo, um, uh, Left 4 Dead 2, uh, a lot of like first person shooters or third person shooters. But I'm horrible at them. I'm complete trash. <laughs> I am trash at Call of Duty and anything like that. Um, but I do enjoy the craft. I do enjoy the skill that it takes to play games like that. So I oftentimes watch uh, video games like that. I do play World of Warcraft. Um, I don't think I'm necessarily bad at World of Warcraft. But I don't think I'm super good. Um, so I like watching people that do play those types of games. Maybe it's like inside of me, I would want to someday produce content like that. Or it could just be an entertainment thing where I do like, you know, because I, I was I was on his chat and I was actually like active on his chat. And I was basically saying that like the vibe of those types of games, because some of them are very um, toxic in like how aggressive people talk to each other but more than anything i feel like that also contributes to the competitive nature of that um that video game like i don't think you're gonna hear me ever telling anyone else like you're trash at dragon's lair but <laughs> but in call of duty that is sort of the norm and it kind of makes you want to be better at the game you know like it's it's like it's like, if you just play those games for the single player aspect, you're missing like a whole subsection of that game. Because multiplayer is really, really great too. But uh, I'm just bad at it. So I watch people that play those types of games. So yeah, if you're interested 
his channel is called Leo D Gamer, and he has started streaming, but he has a lot of content that he's had from past streams, I believe. So yeah, go to him and check him out. Let him know I sent you. Left to right. So this is gonna be left. Oh, I'm I'm doing it again. Uh, on my Nintendo Switch and actually on my PC, I have started playing Doki Doki Literature Club, which I absolutely love. Team Salvato is I pressed it early. Team Salvato is an amazing uh, group of people who developed the game. Uh, did it really well. Like I didn't know the extent of like how big that game was until I absolutely finished the game. Um, and I've been not necessarily looking into more dating sim games because that game is sort of a dating sim. Um, but I've been looking more into like in-depth story arcs. You know, I've been looking into like um, well-developed characters, well-developed backstories. Like I like that kind of stuff. It's like it's amazing how much a person can put into uh, like any sort of piece of work right so um, I'll also I guess <laughs> randomly I'll also plug a Netflix movie that I've been watching but uh, I watched Fear Street 1994 1986 I forget which which year it was I want to say it was 1994 um, so that's part one right so if you go onto Netflix and you search up Fear Street uh, there's gonna be two movies currently because they released part two but I watched part one and I actually really enjoyed part one it's sort of so I had a friend that basically she stopped watching the movie because she's like oh it's so dumb like why didn't they just do this or why didn't they just do that but back in the days in the early 2000s they made movies that were super dumb like scream right if anybody knows what scream is that's a great Wes Craven movie, but arguably the characters are so dumb in the movie. They're the dumbest characters in the movie. So now fast forwarding, you got like Prometheus and all these really great thriller kind of movies that are horror based or insidious or, you know, The Conjuring or Sinister, where those characters are slightly dumb as well. Um, but it's just a trope in, in horror, you know, in in old school horror, people were really, really dumb. Like they were like, you would hear uh, a chainsaw, right? You'd hear a chainsaw in a random barn. It's completely dark. And the main girl would be like, Tommy, is that you? <laughs> like, no, it's not Tommy. You guys didn't come to chainsaw a tree down. Like you're <laughs> like, that's a killer. Leave the place. But um, I loved it. I liked that feel. Like I, it felt like a cheesy horror movie, while being a decent like movie that came out in this freaking current time. Um, so I recommend that. And it is very in depth. Like in the first movie, they had like a whole history of the towns and all that. And now they released the second part, and it was kind of like they went to the history of that town. Like, they explored more on the history, which I loved. Like, I thought it was amazing. And they even, at the very end, um, you know, I'm not going to say too much, but they obviously left it for, like, a third movie, which is cool. I, I, I like movies like that. Uh, I feel like that's why Stranger Things was so popular. Uh, and obviously, you know, they're on their fourth season, so they must be doing something right. But a uh, great movie. I have that's like one of the recent movies I've watched that I've uh, I've enjoyed. Aside from that, I've been listening to a lot of music. Uh, I've been listening to Greta Van Fleet. Uh, I've been listening to actually last night I was listening to the Spice Girls for whatever reason. <laughs> um, I've been listening to what else have I been listening to? The Wallows. I've been listening to the Wallows. Uh, you know, just a lot of different music. This is the point where I get anxious about the dang stages because the timing is required. 
But I'm not I'm not even gonna try. Like if I die, that's fine. I don't care. I don't care if I die. Yeah, there we go. You see? Alright, it is an hour and twenty minutes. I said an hour and fifteen minutes. It's an hour and twenty minutes, so here we go. I do feel a little bit more relaxed, which is strange. I actually feel relaxed a bit. So let's continue. And now for the next 30 minutes, because I am gonna end my stream in two hours. Um I did talk to some people about why I only stream for two hours. I feel like my brain is my brain is really fried after playing two hours of this game. Um, so I feel like my content sort of drops in quality after a certain point, and I don't want to produce bad content. I want to produce good content. So here we go. I'm not gonna say much in the beginning, but yeah, I'm I'm paying attention now. Of course, it's pointing right. It's gonna be left, right. The fact that I was able to play the game while mentioning what I do on this, like what I watch on YouTube, what I watch on Netflix, what I listen to, it's pretty impressive. In the back of my mind, I was like, how am I passing these stages? <laughs> There we go. Right attack. Okay. Okay, let's see what the next room is. The next room is two rights. So one and then two. Uh, two lefts and a right. My favorite room. This is my favorite room. It's currently. Currently. But I do like the Headless Horseman. It's a really nice addition to the game. Uh, left, five rights, and then six attacks. So, one, um, two, three, uh, this will be four, and five. Okay, now we do six attacks. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. Next room, please. Uh-oh. Oh, gosh. My switch was a little bit behind. Uh, right? Or we should be good, right? Yeah, I think we're good. Okay, this is attack up, right, down, left. Up. Up, right, down, left. Up. There we go. We finally figured that one out. I think it was the break. Honestly, I think it was the little break where I didn't, I wasn't trying to play the game. You know, I was trying to talk to you all. I was trying to like, just talk about some random stuff. You know, sometimes you need to step back. This right, up, left, up, right, up, attack, right, up, attack, left, up, attack, left, up. Uh, checkers room, great. Let's see what it is. It's gonna be left, right, up, right, left, right, left. I press left. Oh no, no, that that last left is a it's a it's a cheeky left. It's a cheeky sneaky left. It's a cheeky beaky sneaky left. Man, it comes up on you and it just smacks you right in the back of the head. Oh God, that was so, I, I felt like I had the timing too. I felt like it. Okay, well, I enjoyed that. I really enjoyed that. And honestly, my heart wasn't like, doo -doo 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 -doo. like it wasn't too beeping. Like it was really, I was really calm. I was really calm then. Okay, let's do it. Up, I'm, I'm, I'm like super hyped right now. Up, okay, this is pointing left. So it'll be right, left, right, left, right, right, left, right, left, 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 right, left right left 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 okay we got it we got it it's the next room uh left right left right up 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 right left right left right left right left right and then four ups so oh i pressed up <laughs> up 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 
couple more? No, no, no. Left, right, left, right. Uh, right, left, right, left, right. Right. Left. Right. Left. And then wait for the chain. It's gonna be right. Gosh, there's so much of this game still left. Okay, this is gonna be a right. Wait for the cutback. Right. Here we go. It's gonna be down, down, a uh, six downs and an up. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, up. Uh, up attack, down, up, up. Attack. Down. Up. Uh, this is just going to be a right at the end. I don't know how to get the diamond, so I won't. Up. I mean, sorry, right. Uh, attack. Up. Right. Down. Left. Up. Up. Right. Oh, oh no. You hate it. I hate it when it's so, like, I hate it when I'm so slow that I mess up on an easy room. Oh, it feels bad. And that next one would have been an easy room too. Attack right, attack up. Let's play game, new game. Here we go, here we go. I'm feeling it, I'm feeling it. Like, we have maybe three or four more rooms left to finish the entire game. Once you get past the checkered room, I think it's three or four rooms left in the entire game. So one, two, three four okay it's gonna be right left right left 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 right left right left 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 okay here we go uh up attack up attack left attack up attack up attack left attack there we go all right left to right this is a left wait for the cut back and now i i was gonna say i was about to say don't say anything on that room because you're gonna mess up the timing and I still messed it up because I was thinking in my head that <laughs> I just distract myself so much, you know? And that like little, yeah, that little distraction is what keeps you. Yeah, I, I like, <sighs> I agree. I agree that I should get out of my head, but it's so tough. It's so difficult, it's so hard. It's such a good game too though. All right, here we go. Four rights. One, two, three, four. I am playing so bad. <sighs> Maybe it's time, guys. Maybe it's time. You know? I tried to take a break. I tried to take a rest. And I just, I can't. Like, I can't past simple stages you see, like I, like it's a sociological thing right that's happening like there's we've documented now so much of how i work this is pointing right at a certain point what you receive is less than great content and i and like i'm I'm noticing that, you know what I mean? Like, I'm self-aware to notice that. But it's just, it's crazy how, like, that's an actual thing that can happen. I mean, imagine a person that's, like, a doctor, a surgeon, working, like, 12 hours. They must be, like, military trained where they just can be focused all the time. There's two rights. Okay. 
Oh, I pressed it too early. That's my bad. I'll admit that. That was my bad. Um. <sighs> Had a yawn. Let's do a new game. Let's get some water. It's very rare when the first room has any attacks at all. It's either that up one or the ropes. So I didn't feel too bad for reaching with my right hand to get a glass of water. Okay, this is a right. Maybe I have to press attack to drink that. But I'm not going to find out. We've come too far. The left and then attack. Okay, this is uh, right. Okay, so this is two lefts and a right. So one, um, two, and right. Uh, left, five rights, and six attacks. So right. Right, right, uh, two more, right, and last right, now six attacks, one, two, three, four, five, six, okay, here we go, uh, attack, attack, right, attack, attack, so attack, um, Attack right, because the anvil spawned on the left. Attack. And the last one we have a little bit of time. I guess you could also tell by the gargoyle, or the statue. It's not really a gargoyle. Uh, three attacks and an up. So one, two, three, and up. Uh, left attack, left, left. So, left, attack, left, um, left, right, up, left, up, right, up, attack, left, I always press early on that one. Okay, checkers, here we go. This is left, right, up, left. Oh, it was right! Uh, wait, wait, how, wait, what? I did do left, right, up, left, right? Did I not? Did I do right, left, up? No, 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 impossible. Wait, that's not right. No, I did do left, right, up, left. Did I? I don't even know. That's how that's how much this game takes from me. I'm just Yeah, it's tough, it's rough. Alright. Okay. We can do at the very least we can do until I wanna stop at about 150-ish. Uh, so we can do a couple more. There's like 20 more minutes left. We got this. We got this. So right, 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 right. There we go. I thought there was one more right. It's pointing left, so it's going to go right, left, right, left, 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 right, left, right, left, left, left. Okay. Uh, up, attack, up, attack, left, attack. There we go. Uh, left, right, which one is it? Left, wait for the cutback, and no. Okay, six downs and an up. So we got 
One, two, three, four, five, six, and up. Uh, this is a left, five rights, and six attacks. So, one, two, just a split second late, or early, three, four, five, and then six attacks. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Uh, attack, attack, right attack, attack. Anvil is on the right, left side. And wait a bit. I think the anvil and the uh, statue spawn in the same spot. So it's either one. You can use either one to determine which side you're going to go. Uh, three attacks and an up. So one, two, three, up. is attack right attack up okay is left up right up left and then up attack right That was early there. Okay, here we go. This is left, right, up, left. Oh, it was right. Left, right, left. Oh my gosh. It's so, it's so heartbreaking. Like, it's so heartbreaking, like, how fast I am not, like, that, that was insane, like, it was just a split second, like, it was a split second. That's insane. I don't think that room is actually as predictable as we think it is. Okay, right, 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 right. Okay. Uh, left, right, left, right, right, right. Right, left, right, right, right. Uh, left, right, left, right, up, 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 up. Right, left, right, left, right. Left, right. Uh, up, 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 uh, one more, I mean, well, two more now, two, and this should be the last one, uh, right, left, right, left, right, so, right, left, right, left, and then wait for the chain, and you click right, so right, there we go, uh, two rights, so one, two, uh, six downs and an up, so one, two, three, four, five, six, Up, attack, down, up. Down, up. Uh, attack, attack, right, attack, attack. 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 Right. Attack. And last one takes a while. Attack. Uh, up attack, down attack, right. Attack, 
right? Attack right, attack up. Left, up, right, up. Left, up, attack. Left, up, attack. Right, up. Okay. Do what it does. Left, right, up, right, left, right, left. I, oh, I press it, man. I don't know why. I don't know how. I press that. I press the left. Every single time I press that left, is it just like immediately right, left? If it's immediately right left, then I'm gonna do that. I'm just gonna do that. But I think it's dumb. Like, I think that's... <sighs> you know what? I will do that. I will do that. I am... I'm getting sleepy. <laughs> I've exhausted myself enough to where I feel like I need to take a nap. Here we go. It's just... So much memorization needed, you know? Right, left, right, left, left, left. Okay, left, left. Here we go. Alright, let's continue on. Uh, up attack, up attack, right attack. There we go. Next room, please. Next room, please. Right or left, this is a right. Wait for the cutback and nail. Okay, okay, we got it. We're good, we're golden. Two lefts and a right, always two lefts and a right. One, wait for a bit, and two, wait for a bit, and three. Well, right. Uh, up, attack, down, up. Up, attack, down, up, attack, attack, left, attack, attack, so attack, attack, left, attack, and we can chill for a bit, attack. Right, let's see what's next. Up attack, down attack, right. Attack, down, attack, right. Attack right, attack up, attack, right. Attack, up. Uh, up, up. Attack, right, right. Attack, right, right. Almost forgot that one. Where are we going? Right, left, up, left, right. I forgot that it was the freaking second, um, the second one. I thought it was gonna be based on the first directional. It's the second directional. That's what I was doing wrong. It is the same. Okay. What's this? Attack. Um, up. Up. Attack. Up, up, up. Okay. Okay, that's good. That's fine. That is fine. That is completely fine. I, I am okay with that. Because we got pretty far. It was attack. Up, up. I don't know if we attacked a second time, did we? I don't know if we did. But at the very least, I know that it's attack up up on that room. That's great. I I can't believe we did that. I cannot believe we did that. That is amazing. I am happy now again. The world is right. The sun has come out. I uh, You see a rainbow in the sky. That's how I feel in my heart right now. <laughs>
<laughs> oh gosh, I can't believe we did that. That is an amazing way to end it, unfortunately. I'm still going. <laughs> I still have time to go again. Let's get back to it, huh? Let's do this. Let's do this. I noticed that at the end of my streams, I need to say what I need to do before and then execute. I can't be talking while I'm doing it. Uh, left, right, left, right. It's just, it's just easier that way because then I know, I know which buttons to press ahead of time. Uh, this is gonna be up, 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 up. Like you have your fingers set at that, at that point, right? Like if there's ever a, an attack, I don't want my right thumb to be anywhere but the attack button. And for me, I am using a pro wireless pro controller, right, left, right, left, right. Um, the attack button for me is the rightmost button. In this case, it's A. Uh, wait for the chain and press right. Okay, left, right. This is left. So now. Uh, two lefts and a right. One. This is my favorite room. Two. Three. Uh, up, attack, down, up. Up, attack, down, up. This is right at the end. So it's like a little intermission. There we go. It's up attack, down attack, right? Attack. Right. This one is right up, down, left. Right. Up. Down. Left. This is up. Up. Attack right, right. 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 This one. Okay. Second. Second one. Right. Left. Up. Left. Right. Left. Right. Attack. I was so bad. I was so bad at the end. I got so nervous. Okay, this one was right, right, right. Oh, it was two rights. It was, I even called it, I even called it. Oh, why didn't it give us the monsters? Why didn't it give us the liquid monsters? Okay, we learned a bit. We learned a bit more. That room with the, with the crystal, the magnetic crystal, it's right, right. Right, right. Oh, there's something on my desk. Get off. Get off. There you go. Okay, play, new game, play, play, there we go. I absolutely love this day today. Um, we are getting valuable information as far as like rooms that we needed to learn that we haven't had the opportunity to learn in a very long time. The one thing I am concerned about is that my RNG has been really great. I'm trying to think of rooms that aren't coming out. So that way I don't forget them. Right. Left. Right. Left. 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 And there actually might be more than four rooms because we get that floating one again. Or we've gotten the floating one again. Up attack, up attack, right attack. There we go. Alright, alright, let's get it, let's get it. Uh, two rights. So, one, two. Oh my gosh, I pressed it early. Uh... <laughs> so I went on the upbeat, so if the chomps are like, you know, one, two, three, I went like one, two, three and like on the upbeats where I was snapping when it was like one snap one snap um, 
that's where I went, and if you're off by like a split second, then you're gonna die on that room. It's hard, but I should have. I I don't know. I feel I feel like I should have done better, but oh well. It is what it is. It is what it is. We got two more, possibly, potentially. We got two more. I do want to finish at two hours at the two hour mark. Okay. If this one goes really well, we might not have time for another one. It's pointing left, so right, left, right, left. Left, left. Two more lefts. Okay. Here we go. Uh, up attack, up attack, left attack. There we go. Next one. Please give us some water, man. Okay, left, right. This is a left. Wait for the cutback. And now. What do you got next? Six downs and an up, please. Yeah. There we go. One. Two. Three. I went early. Why? Why am I doing this? Well, we have time for another one, but I absolutely hate like that's the one thing I feel really bad about I feel really bad about just like getting the timing wrong, you know, especially when it's something like that Like I feel like we've played so many of these so many hours. I should not be messing that up But I am only human. It's true. I'm sorry to admit that to you all. I am human and I will mess up. One, two, three, four. Uh, right, left, right, left, left, left. Two lefts. There we go. Uh, left, right, left, right. Okay. Uh, up, 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 up. There'll be four in total. One. Two. Three. Four. Uh, right, left, right, left, right. So, right. Left, right. Oh, uh, see, like, like it's just silly. It's just so silly. It's just so silly that I'm messing up on timing in in the water one. Like the literally the easiest room. It's so weird. Like I don't know what this fun phenomenon is called, but it's so weird. I can't believe this is happening like I just want to give one more good attempt especially because we like we don't fully know those new stages so I desperately want to get to those stages to fully learn them okay this is gonna be right left right left 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 okay Easy, next room. We shouldn't we shouldn't rely on the fact that they're easy. We should just do them. Right le uh, attack. Oh my gosh, I'm saying the freaking wrong things. Um right. Attack. See, like something's happening to me where it's like I'm just I need to take a break. Two rights. One, two. Six downs in and up. Let's not mess this up. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. I could have messed that last one up. If I didn't, if I pressed it a little bit early, I would have messed it up. Left, five rights, and six attacks. So, one. Two. I was 
Wow. Wow, man. Uh, I feel like I have to stop. I feel like I really do have to stop. I'm sorry. Um, it's around two hours mark anyways. Let me bring back... However, let me bring back the lo-fi and the waiting screen. Um, let's bring this back up. Let's turn off the switch audio. Uh, turn lo-fi back on. Uh, okay. See? Here's the thing. Alright. I know we're gonna get it, right? I know one day we'll get this. We will pass this 100%. 100%, no deaths one shot we're gonna pass this we're getting closer every time we play this game every time i stream this game i feel like i'm getting a little bit closer and with you all here supporting me i feel even better about it i know that this content you guys want to watch you all want to watch um so i appreciate that i do live stream i try to live stream every day this weekend i might not be able to live stream thursday to sunday uh just because i'm going to be out of town again but I will be back at it on next Monday. I'll try to stream tomorrow, but we'll see. Um, I want to thank everyone who stayed here for the live stream, who is active in the live stream. Um, it, I am posting this on my channel through the live stream playlist. So if you want to watch this, or if you're watching this post live stream, you can find it on my channel, Other, either through videos or through uh, the playlist live streams. Um, I want to thank everyone who stopped by and also YouTube says I have to say, or YouTube doesn't say I have to say it, they recommend that I say if you all enjoyed the content, please leave, consider leaving a like, commenting, and subscribing. It goes a long way to showing me that the content I'm producing is the content you all want to watch. I'm very tired. I want to do this again. I know we're there. I'm afraid if I go on vacation again, I'm gonna come back not remembering a lot of things, which might happen. It might be something we have to deal with. I have another trip on August as well as another trip on October, but in between then, September, is gonna be our big time. I also wanna announce officially today that I am gonna consider bringing back uh, episodic streams like Limbo, Little Nightmares 2, uh, Jenny LeClue, um uh, figment i think is another one i have that i need to play i will be bringing that soon i just have to find a format that works for me but uh, you know and the best method to do that uh but until then i appreciate you all it is wednesday i hope you all have a great rest of your week it's almost done look forward to the weekend plan something out maybe read a book maybe watch a movie but i hope you guys enjoy the rest of your week and like always we'll see you all on the next one